Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. And hopefully you guys are going to have a fantastic and lovely day. So one kind of cool thing is we actually do have a confirmed PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X, I believe, restock all going on throughout today. So, a lot of stuff to go talk about. So if you guys are, uh, I guess, cool for me to talk about in the first place. So, hi. Hello, hello, hello. We also have, like I said, confirmed stuff. We also have a lot of overdue stuff, a lot of mid-tier stuff, and just everything else all floating around. So, uh, thank you guys all so much for stopping on by. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on, as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc, digital console controller. Twitter and Twitch stream as well, link down below. And sign up for Weeble, sign up for Coinbase, and all the other various good stuff. Those are always linked down below, and let's go dive in the video itself. So, we actually might have a video up on this maybe again, maybe in the next few hours, just for some general tips and tricks and reminders and all of that, but I just want to let you guys go and know we do actually have a confirmed Walmart PlayStation 5 restock ongoing as of today. I believe the time should be all set for it. should be 12 p.m. EST, so that's for noon, so up in like a few hours, like five hours or so. Then it's also at 11 a.m. Central, 10 a.m. Mountain, 9 a.m. Pacific, so just in case you guys are curious. It's for Walmart Plus members only these are for the paid members paid members boys go and rock that stuff on out dude as well so 100 make sure you guys are all on top of that make sure you guys are big trying to get your consoles make sure you guys are just i don't know signed up for it <laughs> you guys have a few hours for all this stuff you guys can be able to look out for it so first and foremost Make sure you guys are a paid membership. I'll probably remind all of you guys in this next video as well, just so you guys 100% fully get it. But make sure you guys are a paid member for Walmart Plus. You need to be a, sorry, I think a paid member for it. If you guys are using the trial, it will not work. You will not be able to access into the queue. You will not be able to go do anything else. You need to go and do that. So if you guys don't, you guys are going to be wasting your time, wasting your money, and it's just not going to be... Cool. So, <laughs> keep that in mind. Uh, from what we've seen so far, the PlayStation 5 disc editions are confirmed. And just based on how the other previous Walmart drops have gone, it's always maybe subject to change. We have the PlayStation 5 disc confirmed on website. PlayStation 5 digital should, at least in theory, be dropping with it. We kind of talked about it before, and as I went and checked it, we didn't go and really see too, too much for it. Uh, although, like, I probably just assume, just probably assume all three will be dropping at the same time. Assume the digital is going to be dropping. Assume the Xbox will be dropping. Assume all that stuff's going to be dropping. In general, that should be some pretty good stuff. So go and watch it. Go be on the lookout for it. And hopefully it goes well for all of you guys. As you guys know, like I said, I'll probably kind of recap some of this stuff in the next video, just as like a reminder. But when it comes to that stuff, make sure you guys are in the queue. Make sure you guys stay in the queue longer than you guys would expect. And on top of that, too, just have a good time. I hope you guys will get your consoles. I will probably go and say that the Walmart Plus drops are usually pretty high up there on the general. Like, people get a lot of stuff. People get a lot of, like, good drops on it. The stock's usually pretty good. We could kind of maybe, hopefully, assume maybe, 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 maybe that we'll have less bots, less scalpers in there, too. Hopefully, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. So it should hopefully be a fun time for all of you guys out there. Major fingers crossed. As well, like I said, the Xbox Series X's will be watching all that stuff too. I'm like pretty, pretty sure this should be all good. We'll probably have more updates as the drop kind of on goes throughout the day or gets closer, etc., etc. And also, many of you use the app or website or whatever. But just be on the lookout for all three. If anything, make sure you guys have separate browsers and stuff. We'll go a little bit more in depth for like tips and tricks and all that for a really quick, like, kind of short video in a little bit. But I hope it's gonna go good. I do want to be honest, most Walmart restocks are pretty solid. Most Walmart restocks pretty good a lot of folks usually end up out of them and they're pretty happy like a lot of folks are like let's go actually good proper drop let's go good kind like proper i guess i don't know consoles drops everything whatever it is it's cool so we like it we enjoy it and i think you guys all hopefully enjoy it too as well so a little bit of a ramble on that one hope you guys don't mind but it is all confirmed and we always like the big confirmed big daddy drops because that means a lot of you guys should hopefully be happy so we'll probably talk about the reactions on it we'll probably talk about the drop itself and we'll probably have maybe a little bit of a quick like quick i guess like tips and tricks like a little mini video before the drop actually happens so all around good stuff i'm excited hope you guys are excited too as well now for other little various stuff too to mention as you guys probably heard, we did actually have a weird target restock that happened as of last day, or yesterday, <laughs> last day. So uh, just in case you guys want to be a lookout for it, we have seen quite a few different other various times where we've seen stock and stock arrivals, and we actually have them confirmed by employees for stock in-house. So just in case you guys do want to pick up any consoles themselves, I would check the Target app, 
for both the Xbox and PlayStation 5. Now, they're not 100% confirmed because it just was really weird. We had a Friday drop, and it seemed like maybe a leftover drop Monday. Uh, so, last like last time, I think it was at like 7.07. This video's going to be up at 7 o'clock. So, if you guys want to check Liddy right now, or just maybe throughout the next half hour, it was also regional too as well. So I don't want to like debate you guys, make you guys waste your time. So that's why I should just maybe do it nice and quick and easier. Check the website. They're not maybe just like kind of refreshed every like five or ten minutes or so. Uh, it did also kind of see like maybe some bots were getting on that and two as well. So maybe the likelihood does tone down. But I just do want to do remind you guys that we did see people get consoles. Like people did go and check out, and that same day people did go and get their consoles. Although it was weird uh, because they're like I said, it was in my region did not have any stock. Like there's just nothing there. So uh, yeah, not good, not fun, not anything at all really in all honesty so we well, gotta go and see i'd probably say it's worth checking throughout the day especially for playstations ps5 digitals probably not so much because the stock is just so abysmally low xbox series x is obviously sure but i'd probably say that's just like for maybe like the next hour or so as you guys are lingering chilling and all that and then once again the big 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 daddies and the one more plus drop which we'll be seeing in a little bit so that's i think probably gonna be the most important one probably the best one for all that so we'll be watching that all throughout today now for other little very stuff too Best Buy. As you guys have been seeing, we do keep on seeing like little small bits and pieces. We did not go and see any total tech drops, which does make me a little bit on the sadder side for Best Buy. It's just not good. We didn't really see too much. We didn't rock anything else in general. It just wasn't wasn't good. Uh, but we do know that there's been some stock in warehouses floating around, and we just know it's uh, in general kind of a little bit on the overdue side too as well for online. Now, uh, we have been seeing a few little sporadic, although not as much, not as often, Best Buy is having their PlayStation 5s uh, for the walk-in using the app glitch and checking online and checking their usual like terms and all that stuff. So, we are still watching for it. We're also waiting for it. So, we'll have a chance to go and hopefully go and see with it in the near future. So, stock's looking not the worst. Looking all right-ish. Not too bad. So, PlayStation 5, as I said, be on the lookout for them. Xboxes, be on the lookout for them. Also, just in-store in general for Best Buy. And as well, all the GPUs too as well, just in case you guys do want to be the lookout for Amazon, we always do have the Amazon links down below, so we have been closely watching for them to go and see what's up and all that good vibe. So in case we do see any stock or stock arrivals, with that, we'll let you guys go and know. So all around good stuff with that. Uh, we haven't seen like too much movement, too much arrival, too much anything at all. Uh, but if you guys want to go and casually check and see, we haven't seen any updates on stuff. We haven't seen any movement on stuff. We haven't seen really pretty much in all, in all honesty anything on that. So we'll keep you guys in the loop the best we can for that. And as well, GameStop, we have still been hearing some rumors for them. We did not go and see any like member tweets or pro emails or Facebook tweets or anything like that. It's just not been too good, so we'll win for them as well. Well, they're also on the overdue side, so we'll be watching that throughout the week, like we mentioned on the weekly video. So that's, I think, about all it for all the really, really big boyos. So Walmart, 100%. I want you guys to be, if you guys really want to get your consoles, please, please, please go. Be on the lookout for Walmart. Please put a big attention on it. Please focus on it. Please, like, it's just, like, going to be a golden spot. I hope it works out for a lot of you guys. Like, I really, really hope it's going to be a good drop for you guys. So, all around, big thumbs up for that. Now, for the little various things, too, and online, we can maybe still see a worked-in PlayStation 5 digital. Now, with that, we can see the bundles, or if they want to do an additional promotion slash mention of the Xbox Series X bundles, we can go and watch them pretty, pretty closely. Same thing with Gamefly, too. We've been mentioning Gamefly and probably will mention them a lot throughout the week. They're just very much on the overdue side for the PlayStation 5 bundles on their end. So be on the lookout for them. Be on the watchful eyes for them or whatever you just want to go and be on the lookout for. Costco, PlayStation 5s, and bundles overdue very much. Same with the Xbox. So we'll be watching for that in these early hours, next few hours. Sam's Club, not so much on the overdue side, but just in case, there's going to be the lookout for it. Also, guys, don't forget about the new egg day-to-day -day shuffle, trying to get their consoles for all that. We did not go into any PlayStation 5 bundle or PlayStation 5 invites from the PlayStation Directs at all, which is a little bit on the sadder side for that one. We have been watching to wait and see. So just be on the lookout if you guys get one, send me a tweet, send me a message, email, or whatever, and keep me in the loop for that. As well, Microsoft Directs keep on checking online, and also, as we mentioned before, all their in-store purchases, even Walmart, where their Xbox Series X is available up in-store. So we'll be watching for all those. Nice and dandy. Uh, Kroger's, Fred Myers, and BJ's wholesalers are all on the overdue side for online side, as well as to be on the lookout for that. Same with military as well. We have been seeing reports of Myers for in-store stock. We'll give you guys more details throughout the next few days. Usually Wednesday and Thursdays, I believe, are also pretty big restock days as long as the weekend. So if that kind of continues the trend, we'll give you guys more details. And the same, we have been still seeing sporadic BJ's 
PS5 Ratchet and Clinks up in stores. Same thing too as well with the other various free retailers. We're gonna be watching to see if there's any even more like uh, Verizon and Dormas and all the other mid-tier locations sitting around for that. So if we do see any stuff, we'll let you guys go and know. But I just want to give you guys a quick heads up. Good luck on the drops. Uh, let me know how it goes. We'll probably have a few more videos, maybe even have a talk on Walmart Plus in a few hours. Spin a look out for that. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc digital console controller. Twitter and Twitch stream as well link down below and sign up for that Weeble, sign up for that Coinbase and all that other various good stuff. I appreciate you guys all so much for watching and yeah, thank you guys all so much for being here. Love you guys.